Midland County Commissioners welcomed a new road today near Monahan's Draw Bridge. South County Road 1232 will hopefully alleviate some of the stress brought by traffic near the I-20. The road will help drivers get from the I-20 South to Highway 158 with the road crossing over 1210. It ends construction of a road that, according to Precinct 3 Commissioner Luis Sanchez, began in 2020. The planification and the work took about three to four years. Um, you know, a lot of the work really was done in the last couple of years. So it took some time, but we're able to, to get the money together, get it done. So we are very excited that it's finally open. Hopefully this will take some of the stress off of the traffic locally, uh, south of I-20 in our, in our residential areas. The road has been requested for quite some time from Midlanders looking for another way to travel around the interstate. Midland County has been receiving calls to see if we could have some type of a corridor south of Interstate 20 because really the only corridor that they had was Interstate 20. So this is definitely going to help out with a lot of the traffic and, you know, a lot of the development that's going on out in this area. When it comes to funding, Midland County wasn't alone in building this road. As 80% of the section built over the draw will be reimbursed thanks to a state grant. Part of the project is funded by a, central, or a county infrastructure transportation fund a grant from TxDOT that we received um, back in 2020, and uh, the rest of the money came from taxes from the county. But while one road is done, there is still work to be done all around the city, something Sanchez is keenly aware of. We're going to continue to work on a lot of the neighborhood roads. We are currently working on West County Road 120, where it will be opened from Midkiff Road all the way to this new Loop 250, also West County Road 130. So we are going to continue with a lot of the road projects that we've got in Precinct 3. In Midland, I'm Jason Freund, News West 9.